<laughs> we made it to Dirty Turtle off road. I'm gonna do some sending it with the younger generation. A team wax off road. turtle you've got some cabins lined up out here where you could stay at for a few nights you got a whole lot of them. prices uh, you could probably look them up on their website so we actually got some bathrooms out here that are real nice and clean if you ever need to go during the ride
just finished our ride at Dirty Turtle Off-Road Park, and I ain't done an outro like this in a long time. Feels kind of weird, but I'm going to give you all our thoughts and our opinions on the place, and we'll just start off by saying it does have a, it is a small park. It's 270 acres, but it's directed more to a different kind of audience instead of side-by-sides and all that stuff. It's directed more towards four-wheel drive trucks and Jeeps and rock bouncers, because, you know, as you've seen in the video, there's a lot of long hills. And they got all kinds of rocks and bumps and zigs and zags and all that stuff. Not really four side-by-sides, but they will go through them. But I will say, if you're on a side-by-side -side and you like to ride a little bit faster, then you will get through the majority of the trails pretty quick. But if you're on one of them little rock buggies or jeeps and all that stuff that you kind of crawl through the trails, you can make a pretty long day through that place. So it's kind of fun either way. If you've never been, it's pretty cool. And if you're into the rock bouncers, obviously it'll be fun. But that's about our gist of the place, you know, for some people it'd be fun and some people you'd be going through it pretty quick. But I hope y'all enjoyed the video and if you did, please drop a like. And if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. Leave a comment on what you thought on this place and share the channel with everybody else. Help us get to 1K and I'll see y'all in the next video.